In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to change the orientation of only one slide in PowerPoint. This is a handy skill to have for those moments when you want to display a single slide in a different orientation without altering your entire presentation. Let's dive in and get started. First, open PowerPoint on your computer. Ensure that you have the presentation you want to work on ready and accessible. It's important that you're familiar with your file's location because you'll need to access it shortly. Next, go to your PowerPoint presentation. Once you have your presentation open, locate the specific slide you want to change the orientation for. Remember, this method allows you to switch one slide's orientation without affecting others. Now click on the Insert tab at the top of the PowerPoint window. This tab houses many tools and options that allow you to enhance your presentation, and today we'll focus on one of them in particular. Moving forward within the Insert tab, find and click on Object. This option enables you to insert various types of content into your slides, including another entire PowerPoint file, which we'll do shortly. Once you've clicked on Object, choose the option that says Create from File. This step is crucial because it allows you to locate and insert a specific file from your computer directly into your current slide. After selecting Create from File, click on the Browse button. This will open a file explorer window where you can navigate through your computer's directories. Here you need to find the specific PowerPoint file that contains the slide in the alternative orientation, so make sure to have it saved beforehand. When you've located your portrait presentation file, click on it to select it, and then make sure to check the box that says Display as Icon. By doing this, you're ensuring that the selected slide will visually appear as an icon on your current slide, rather than displaying it in full, which offers better control. Once all of this is done, go ahead and click on OK. Now, you've successfully inserted the icon representation of your alternate orientation slide into your presentation. It's all set up to open the desired content when interacting within your presentation. The final step is presenting the slide. Start the slideshow from the slide where you've inserted the icon. When you click on this icon during your presentation, it will open your portrait presentation. This method cleverly uses the PowerPoint functionality to bypass the limitation of singular orientation per presentation by essentially linking to a separate file for the desired slide. And there you have it, you've now learned how to change the orientation of a single slide in PowerPoint without affecting the entire presentation. Feel free to revisit any parts of the guide if you need further clarification and experiment with this technique to enhance your presentations. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.